Life is so beautiful in every sense and we should love it for being so. It can be more pleasant when we are fit, healthy and ready to enjoy every moment presented to us. Hello beautiful people, Sashikal, I hope you all are doing great. So as you might have made from the words that I am using, either it's going to be about health or about being healthy. But I am not going to talk about some gymming, training or exercising. Today it's going to be about some changes in our daily lifestyle either at home or in office which are going to help us in getting a healthy and fit body. So let's begin. Number 1. Don't be a couch potato. We don't realize how much time we waste every day sitting in front of our laptop going through some random websites and our social media a zillion times a day. So instead of doing this, stand up and do some work. You can do household chores like cleaning the room, making the bed, helping your mom and dad in their work respectively, cleaning the bathroom, doing dishes, doing laundry. There are a number of things to do on a day-to-day basis. Doing everyday work yourself can help in reducing so many calories while saving a lot of money. Usually there is a 2 minute commercial in the TV series in which either we sleep or we change from one channel to another. So instead of wasting your time and shuffling through channels when we are not getting anything interesting, get up and start dancing. You can dance, you can stretch your body, you can skip, you can walk and once the program starts once again, sit down and enjoy. Number 3. Studies show that calories burn a lot better standing than sitting. Even if you do nothing while standing, replacing a couple of hours of sitting with standing can help burn a few extra calories. So if you are at home and even if you are working in an office, you can make a full day where you are just standing and doing your work. You can take calls, you can take notes and if possible, you can work on your computer as well. Number 4. Go for brisk walking or jogging every morning and evening. It helps in losing weight, tones up the body, uplifts the mood and even strengthens the heart. Moreover, it doesn't pose any risk of injury as compared to gym or running. Number 5. If you have free time or you are sitting idle at home, instead of wasting your time in front of TV or computer, go out and do some adventurous sport. Remember when we were kids, we never wanted to leave the game we were playing no matter how much dirt, dust, sweat we were drenched in? So do the same thing now. If we want the same energy to come back, we have to play sports. We have to be child once again. So play the sport of your choice, be it badminton, tennis, basketball or even swimming. Number 6 and probably the easiest of them all, get a good 8 hour sound sleep. If you want to tone down or shape up your body, sleeping good is as important as sweating in the gym. So sleep tight and that's all you have to do. Number 7. These days elevators are everywhere. I completely understand if you need to go to 17th floor, you can take a lift. But what about 2nd floor? So instead of wasting your time waiting for the lift, take stairs and stay healthy. Number 8. Try walking shorter distance. But if you are taking a car either to your office or mall or to a client for a meeting or you are parking near your home, try parking at the farthest point available. By doing this, you will be walking some extra steps every time you are getting on or off the car. Number 9. While working in an office, instead of calling people to come up to you, just hang up the call and try walking to them. You can burn calories by doing so and also you can bitch about your boss or colleagues and you don't know that you are burning calories. Number 10. Change your mental attitude. If you continue seeing yourself unappealing, flabby, chubby, fat, you are never going to try weight loss change. Make a mental shift. Try writing all the positives and negatives that you think that you have. Adopt a positive attitude and put in the effort to see the change in yourself. 
Once you have listed all your qualities and negatives, you will get to know that you have so many positives as compared to negatives. This is going to help you a lot. A better mental approach can make the progress more precious. Instead of wasting your time by searching some websites, going through your social media zillion times or playing some brainless games, try watching some good videos. You can search exercise or good food videos on YouTube. You can also read magazines or newsletters related to good health, healthy body and healthy food. Even fashion magazines sometimes help. So I hope you find these small changes in day-to-day -day life easy and useful. Soon I'm planning for a video regarding dietary changes. Do let me know if you would like to watch it. And I will see you in my next video. Till then, stay healthy, stay blessed.